What's he think I look like? A jackass? Well, sir, that's how it all began. Hi, I'm Norman John. Knoxville, welcome to Disney Jackass. And this is the marching band. There's drama, there's excitement, and there's this. Join the fun. This job is here for everyone. You'll find no. rhythm, ladies. No romance, no reason to drive. Something ridiculous. To work your We're time. Okay, I got a heart head. Oh my god, you alright? Oh yeah, I'm fine. Oh my god, he's bleeding. My hair almost receding. Steve, are you okay? Somebody's you alright, Steve? Oh dude. Oh, yeah. oh. oh. man, that happened fast. All that practicing. Right out the window. I feel like I'm coming back to myself, but I can't remember nothing. I didn't wipe out, did I? No, yeah. You still got those million dollar teeth, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> They're dropping like flies. This is the Chop House Melody. Memory of the snow jam and winter time long ago. Now hold on here. On the frozen pond, folks are swaying. Once upon a winter time. Here in this wonderland, romance is the theme. For this is the story of love's young dream. Oh, 
Steve. Go, 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 On the pages of Troll in Soul, a legion of jackass men have left the symbols of their greatness. And strangely enough, this is the symbol of one of the mightiest jackass men of all. Family of John Knapp, a real life jackass. With the passing years, however, reality shows has given way to legend. Until today, we know this remarkable man simply as Johnny Hotsa. This is his story. Listen. Well, sir, every time I hear Colonel Knott, I think of Johnny Knox. Well, by shucks, there wouldn't be no chap guess that weren't for Johnny. No, sir. This man had went and busted this. Well, guess I better start back to the beginning. And that's when Johnny lived in the So what happens when you show up in L.A.? Like, like Not much. <laughs> Not much happened for a long time. You know, I look for audition but not very hard I was more interested in trying to live the lifestyle that people who had made it live I, I just didn't I didn't have any desire at all to go to college I just wanted to be something you know I probably didn't have the greatest plan in the world in hindsight which was none. I don't care if I'm 85 and I finally get one role in a film. That's where I was at in my head. So how old are you in this picture, which is basically the coolest picture I ever taken? I look to be six and uh, I, was, I was a pretty mean little kid. My father put me up to hitting his friends in the nuts. And <laughs> I uh, really, really had a foul mouth from the age of three. Uh, I guess, I guess I still do a little. And you but... still hit people in the nuts, too. <laughs> Hi, I'm Johnny Knoxville. Welcome to Jackass. Hey, you was to toss them, or maybe they're around. One, <laughs> we didn't think it was going to get allowed on television. And then it got on television, we're like, well, it's not going to be on too long. And then we should do a movie. No, we can't do a movie. We didn't have the utmost confidence in what was going to happen. When did you know that it was going to be a film? Probably when I got offered the cover of the Rolling Stone, which was crazy. Now, just to look at him, you'd say Johnny Huxley never would make a picture. Of course, that didn't phase Johnny none. Now, he weren't too bright. He didn't much care. I love what I do, and I'm very fortunate. I just want to keep going. <laughs> well, sir, now you know the reason why I think of Johnny Cook's though. <laughs>